the, the, the first thing I, I'd like to mention is with the barcode technology that many people are familiar with, it's been around for, for many, many years in many, many industries, um, you're working with, with uh, assets or items um, generally one at a time. If you're out doing a physical inventory or a cycle count, you need to locate this asset, uh, hit it with the barcode reader, this asset, hit it with the barcode reader. reader. So it's, it's very, um, you know, one-off. Whereas with RFID, you can, you know, you know at, the, at the lowest levels of the technology, it is one-off, but it, things happen so rapidly, it gives the user the appearance that they're doing, um, you know, uh, many, they're inventorying many, many assets in a matter of, you know, a few seconds. Um, as well with barcode, it's a, it's a very line of sight and I really need to, you know, basically be very close to the asset uh, generally in order to, to accomplish uh, the task that I'm trying to accomplish. With RFID, um, it, I can get, I can uh, read uh, hard to reach items, uh, embedded items, uh, hidden tags, things that might be in a case or a, or a cardboard container. Um, we, we were uh, talking with a third-party logistics company just this week. They, they deal with uh, clothing for the retail industry where they take in a lot of uh, material or uh, assets for, from, other, from an assortment of companies that they then, upon uh, order placement, have to ship directly to their stores. And their challenge with being in a big space and being able to find everything they need to fill the orders, uh, certainly in a timely fashion, um, inventorying things uh, with, with the barcode uh, solution they have in place today. Cases need to be opened. Each item individually has to be, to be uh, inventory. And with the RF, RFID uh, capability, they don't have to open all these cardboard boxes. They can inventory pallets of stuff very, very uh, rapidly. They can uh, inventory high, very hard to reach items without having to uh, uh, use a forklift or a high ladder to get an individual up there. So tremendous savings uh, in, in time uh, when you implement uh, the RFID capabilities. Can you quantify that? I mean, what kind of uh, speed uh, enhancements would they get with something like R RFID you know, versus barcode? I mean, every, every um, circumstance is, is different, but I, I think a, just for a rule of thumb, I mean, I certainly feel comfortable saying 10 to 1. You know, if it would take me an hour to invent, uh, or 10 hours to inventory a warehouse of X square feet, um, I would say I could certainly do it an hour with RFID, probably faster. Yeah, yeah, that's a great point. And I, you know, I'll add that, uh, you know, when it comes to, processes that require, you know, a discipline like barcode tracking or RFID tracking, the easier it is to do, the more frequently and the more likely people are going to do it and do it completely, right? And that only Correct. improves accuracy at the end of the Correct. day, and that's what this is about, getting that accurate picture of what's, what's in your custody and, and within your control. 